Keynote speaker at the event, Dr. Yosef Crespi, an ear, nose, and throat specialist, has done extensive research on the causes of halitosis or bad breath. He was eager to share his knowledge on how to treat this condition effectively using water lace. ENT doctors have been using lasers probably for about three decades or more. Uh, they were first to adapt lasers in their surgical armamentarium, more so than any other uh, subspecialties. So bringing a new wavelength, a new device with specific parameters, specific uh, laser tissue interaction effect, such as soft tissue and heart tissue effect, it's a new event for otolaryngologists and uh, it will lead the future for ENT surgery. 70 million people in this country, they suffer from bad breath. It's constant. It's not that you're having a, a garlic or onion that's going to go away two, three hours. It's day after day, night after night, persistent bad breath. What's happening is the bacteria in, the or, in their oral cavity, they breaks down on the protein and they produce this volatile sulfur compounds as gases. And it can be quite disturbing to the immediate uh, environment, say at work or at home. Uh, management can be quite difficult. Uh, typical books will uh, advise mechanical and chemical therapy, meaning brush your teeth, uh, scrape your tongue, uh, use a, a mouthwash to decrease the bacteria count. That's not enough. Uh, certainly for the most people that they have chronic bread breath, uh, they have perfect teeth, perfect gums, and you have to search for other sources. The source, 99% of the time, is in the mouth, the back of the tongue, or the tonsils. Look for the source, treat the source. Dr. Crespi tells us how halitosis became his area of interest. This was uh, my research hobby for the last decade. I've been lecturing around the world about bad breath. And my passion has been lasers for many years. So uh, my goal was to find out a laser wavelength, a laser uh, tool or a device in order to decrease the bacteria count to the level that they're not going to be totally eliminated. However, they can be managed for a long term. And the 940 laser and the water lace becomes a hand-to-hand -to -hand tool where we can decrease effectively the bacteria count, the back of the tongue, and at the tonsil area to improve bad breath. Similar, my vision is, uh, that's what I'm going to teach tomorrow to 300 dentists. I'm going to show them how to reduce the bacteria in their oral cavity once they're done with clean teeth and clean gums in the back of the tongue. Very simple. You take the water lace, uh, you have water energy, air energy, and also laser energy to decrease the coating in the back of the tongue. Patients will come to the dental office similar to their annual or biannual visit for dental cleaning. They will receive tongue cleaning to maintain their oral bacteria in a manageable level for these patients to not to suffer.